Welcome back to the Bloodshed. Uh, tonight we're going to be playing Bloodshed Roulette again, where he's going to throw a dart at the board. Whatever number it lands on, we will go to uh, Tubi. We're going to use Tubi this time. Yes, right? we're gonna use Tubi. Go to Tubi, go to the horror section, count along that number. That's what we're going to watch. We're going to talk about it. This time I'm going to try and keep the camera set up the whole time so we can catch some reaction stuff if need be. All right, here we are at the dartboard. Just apologize for the shakiness. I'm kind of holding the camera. So you ready? I'm ready. All right, shoot away. Oh, what is it? Is it 25 or is it bullseye? Seven. Seven. Oh, okay. I was way off. All right, so seven it is. Off to the TV we go. All right, so we've decided to use the recommended tab because these look like some, some crazy things. I've seen two, no, three out of what's on the screen here right now. But we got seven, so we're going over two, three, four, five, six, seven. Have you seen this? No, I have not. I have, but I think it will be really funny for you to see it with me. Oh yeah, we get the, uh... <laughs> oh my God. We get the, uh, knockoff seven intro. <laughs> I've seen a lot of wood. Like, I've seen a lot of wood here. Oh, the whole one. <laughs> It's a tomb of some sort. Put it back. <laughs> <laughs> Jingani no around. Uh, Jingani's gone, uh, sir. Uh, oh, I found Jindani. <laughs> I found Jindani. I don't think he's in the mine. I cannot guarantee the safety of the dog. Oh. What the fuck? A dog got possessed. Oh, boy. But he's locked in here. Leave her. Yeah, it <laughs> just left her. Nobody like... noticed she fell. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. I hate him so oh, much. Man. <laughs> I actually jumped. Please tell us the plot, you lady. Please. Spell it out for us. I don't know whose beer this is supposed to be. Yeah, it's heavy He's getting all like it's like <laughs> Scarecrow. Very scarecrow, yep. <laughs> and he got electrocuted. Bitch just goes for the phone. I was like, nah, he's dead, let's go. It was very spirit Halloween, but like good spirit Halloween. <laughs> the bitch is outside. She made it. Hmm? But no, she gotta go back for the sister. Yeah, of course she did. <laughs> Bitch, if you were just gonna tell me to just go, I would have just went when I had the door open. Right? <laughs> Bitch, don't just sit there with the saw. Right. Help! Use the saw. <laughs> he's, he's a lot less threatening, missing an arm. God. The battery died, obviously. <laughs> Did he throw his arm back? <laughs> I'm not sure. She is going to die. Why go back? Why is Boy Skitter back? Right? It's further to go back. Than it is to go forward. Yeah, I don't arm. know, his arm's still missing. Okay. Because, yeah. you know, of all the shit I've seen here, that would be the most unbelievable thing would that right. his arm would have grown back. If she breaks the idol, does that, like, fix it? Because if she cracks that motherfucking thing over his head, is that good? Hey, movie's over. We're back. I'm hoping I can salvage a few clips from, from, from us watching it, because I think that'd be really funny. Mm -hmm. I've seen this movie before. I love this movie a lot. It's really cheesy, but, like, not in an over-the-top kind of way. It's just a cheesy B-movie. It's very by the numbers. Definitely PG-13-ish. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, what would you think? This is your first time seeing Me, movie. I loved it. I honestly thought it was a really, really good, uh, well-done movie. Favorite kill? There you go. Suffocation girl, and then you got the uh, <clears throat> the one that was he was kind of attacked off screen, the the, the tour guide. Guy. Oh, him, yeah, yeah, yeah. And got Buddy in the jail cell with Demon Dog, and you got the electrocution guy. Why don't I have to go with the the the, uh, the sand? The sand, the sand is the best one. one. Yeah, I gotta say, no one ever not thinking about him. Like that was probably the best kill out of all. The plot line is pretty generic. This guy has keys to the haunted house that uh, he's working at. They go in there. The one that owns is after, like, bringing home this weird artifact, which, you know, put it back. Put it back. <laughs> but <laughs> shouldn't have took it in the first place. And what have we learned from <laughs> Every other movie that we've yeah. ever seen. Put it back. Put it back. Leave Don't it alone. <laughs> 
but no, she's after bringing this back. This thing makes your biggest fears come true. So they go through the haunted house, getting picked off one by one by their biggest fear. Uh, so Missy at the end wins by basically facing her fears and breaking the statue. Yeah. That she's afraid of scarecrows. I like the scarecrow. <laughs> it's clearly just a man going around dressed as a scarecrow. It's so, but it's a really good scarecrow. <laughs> it's so funny when Buddy is just shooting the scarecrow. I'm like, you're not going to kill the scarecrow. The fist fight. And the fist fight with the scarecrow. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, freaking yeah. Elbow drops. Oh my it's god. Like, what? All right. It's just wonderful. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was fun. That was fun. Mm -hmm. It's interesting to watch one of these movies, and it's one that I've seen a few times and you haven't seen. With that being said, I do believe that's all we have to say about it. So we'll see you in the next video, okay? Right. Bye! Bye-bye!